Hello. Hello, good morning, good evening. Welcome to the Walking Dead live stream. For those of you watching, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Notify your friends, tell everybody, join us today while we play The Walking Dead. We're gonna go find Bitbender in the game. He's on. And we do have two new faces here. One is yeah. Taco, everyone knows from Gala Music and from Gala Drops. And also Smiley Monster. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Welcome. Excited to be here. So, uh, Bitbender just did a very nice giveaway there. So, let's see where he is right now. He's next to his base. He was oh. upgrading. I think he's gathering resources now. Ah, M30? Yep, oh, M30. He's still alive. Let's, me, let's go there. Uh, I think it's Johnny that's showing the, the, the game screen. Yep, I'm on my way to M30 right now. Mm -hmm. And I think that we do have video from taco but not audio so let's see okay i think i'm gonna drop from my alliance oh, i think i'm i'm in bitbender alliance from the last time let's... Yep, you teleported in when i made yeah, the alliance you don't teleport there boom that was a good 10 minutes explaining how to create an alliance so we can teleport. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm seeing here people from Evergen. Oh, here. Oh, the, his HQ is a lot of floor space. I can see Guru here. Oh, here's my monster. I remember he's along the road somewhere. Mm. I found uh, Snigger Fritz. Am I close? Hey, Smiley, did you got any new hero in the last days? Well, I, I FOMO'd into a mystery box and I got yeah. the exact same pull that I did the first time. I was like, no! <laughs> I did manage to trade with the community and swap out some heroes. So the first one I got was an Ancient Daryl and a Legendary Glen, and then the second box was the same. And I'm in negotiations with a few people and then just trading back and forth. So I can swap out the Ancient and Legendary. Mm -hmm. uh, Ancient Daryl is kind of like uh, one hero that a lot of people wanted. So. Well, Daryl is the like favorite on the show, right? And yeah. everybody likes the crossbow solo lone wolf type guy. He's my favorite, cool. so um, I'm glad I got him. And then I'm going to try and get a bunch of like epic and legendaries for when extra heroes actually become useful. So when you can place some crafting stations, when you can put them on like the towers, free arm traps, maybe even expeditions. I'm slowly gathering my little survival hero collection. Yeah, I, I really do hope that they they are also added like different like more like passive things, not passive, but maybe like adding. A hero to the salvager. Oh, the wrong way. Who oh, no, knows? So maybe. I had a really good idea. Like currently, the decorations in the HQ they currently don't do nothing, right? They're just there for display and make it look cool. But well, mm -hmm. what happens if you had, for example, a command table, and then if you had a command table in your HQ, it gives like a five percent bonus for your expedition to come back with good loot and then if you have like a bed for each hero the mood increases so when they're on a crafting station they get like a flat 10 percent boost to whatever they produce it's, i think it's in the the document i sent you but there's a bunch of ideas that could be really good for headquarters and when the additional heroes become usable in game true true the, the remember that the fallout like fallout 3 i think or at least fallout 4 the game mechanic where they you you place like your like your junk, uh, not junkyard, not like a salvager, and then it kind of yep. produces a little bit of components from time to time. That's one thing that I, I don't know. I do hope that they add to the game. 
Not a lot, of I'd course. I'd love that. Just like a little bit. Well, not enough to set it up as an AFK farming method, right? You yeah. still have to interact and play with the game, but yeah. you should be able to use your additional heroes and get like small benefits with yeah. them. Because right now it's just you play one hero, and since it's still a play test, you're still testing like quite a lot of features. But one hero right now is a good thing to focus on. And then when the additional hero content does come out, it should be a good idea where you should be able to use at least a couple. Not like your whole army, because some people have like hundreds and like 20 and 30 heroes. But at least a good 10 heroes should be like placeable in your base and have a, a use case. Yeah. And of course, they in the past, they comment about like the heroes giving like buffs or difference in in, in the recipes, like he yep. consuming less resource or things. But I yep. don't know, maybe like adding Eugene and then like from time to time a few bullets extra in the chest. Yeah, so it'll be based on characteristics, right? So if you have a Glenn and you send him on the expedition because he's the scout or like scavenger, he gets bonus resources if you send him to get resources. If you have a Eugene and you place him on, I think it's the Ford, no, it's the Arsenal, he'll be able to craft ammo, like give you a better chance of crafting ammo. Or like when you craft with Eugene on the station, you get like a percentage of your resources back. There's so many ideas you can do based on the show characteristics and the heroes. True. Also, Sevi from YouTube. We need cabinets that can be locked. Many people jump clans and steal from players. This is one of the things that I do really wish that they had. So a basic privacy feature, uh, there's several options. The main HQ flag, you should be able to, your alliance member should be able to put items in, but they shouldn't be able to see what is there. So you have privacy because some people just go up to chests and be like, oh, you've got like 200 metal, give me some. So that protects yeah. you that way. Then your wooden chest, weapon lockers, sturdy chest, mini fridges, all of those like mini items that you can place. You should basically just have an option to select if you want everybody to access it, if you want your alliance to access it, or just have an input of certain names that you can um, give access and there should be different tiers. So there should be like drop in. So just put items in, then you have drop in, take out, and then you have like co-owner. So I think that would be a good change to implement. Just when the Alliance and Empires uh, updates come in, have like the resources and permissions. And we have yeah. another question from Crypto Genie. When will you be able to combine heroes to upgrades? Ooh. So you'll have to ask Doug on that one. Doug, when can we look forward to combining our heroes? Because it was said it oh, would happen March. this month, but it's near the end of the month. Yeah, we do not. We're gonna need more time for the merging ability, because I know that right now we are adding. We're gonna add in the future, like very close. Not gonna get give a date, but we're gonna give like the full metadata first for the for the heroes. You no, know, like mm -hmm. the level, the XP, and of course, why is important metadata is for being able to, to to trade, to send like to trading open sea, or trading like sending to a friend and etc. Already level up character, and this is connected with the merging. So this is like a another stepping stone to in the future you're gonna have the merging ability. We don't have ATA right now. We are still missing the one piece of the puzzle, not in terms of technical, but also for for information for us, for we. For example, do we need to level up to level 20, level 40? What's going to be the, the minimum level to be able to merge? And we do. We are going to have a EMA this December. I'm just waiting for the final date. It's going to be like by the middle of the, the month. And this, I think, need to be one of the first questions because I'm curious too. What's has up, guys? By the way, set? yo, uh, Jehu, how's it yo, going? I just, I just realized Paul just put me in the gameplay footage. I was like, I didn't even realize. Hey, that. I saw my face pop up in the screen. I was like, what the heck's going on? What's up, everyone? How you guys doing? Some island monster. Oh, we, what's up, Taco? How you feeling, man? Good to see what's you. What's going on, buddy? Man. Chill it. Um, Doug, you feeling good too? I know we got Nephilim tiny in the building um yeah how's it how's everybody doing today doing good just answering questions yeah. hey. what's up guys hopping in a little mm -hmm. late so we've got smiling and taco in here so i'm feeling a little bit uh feeling a little bit like of a third wheel but i'm maybe like the seventh wheel or something 
<laughs> it's all good. We should do an event. We've got enough people to do something. You should have yeah. an event where Bitbender goes to PvP and we defend him and the community try and kill him. Oh, that would be cool. <laughs> I love the idea. But we need to try and, and get him every time he here. dies, he does a giveaway. That would be funny. I'm trying to look yeah. for you guys here. Let me see where you guys are at again. Um, I think it, I think my icon is can't show me the location. Can you guys tell me what your location is? We are right now in the oh. Bitbender base. Oh, you, oh yeah, you guys with Bitbender? <laughs> Just um, join yeah. his alliance and then get there faster. Okay, yeah. let, me, let me do that right now. Bitbender's On guild. the topic of merging heroes, have we? do we have any information? If um, They said it might cost dead coin, and the merged heroes, will they be burned or will they be put back into like the the marketplace? Based on chat. Uh, you're talking about the dead coin? Yes, so I believe yeah. one of the previous AMAs, they said it will, you probably have to level your heroes now. Your heroes okay. levels will be kept, and you might need to pay a little fee in dead coin to merge yeah. them. But From when they are merged, do the three heroes disappear? Are they burned, or are they going back into the marketplace? Yeah, for the, for the first part of the question about the dead coin, mm -hmm. yes, you're going to need a, a little bit of dead coin, uh, exact amounts to, to be the... Um, announce it in the future about the burning or going to the vault or something i think they're going to be burned uh, i don't have okay, like interesting totally official uh, info but i think they're going to be burned just because is the usually like the usual mechanic when doing that in the world gala of, burned or like normal burnt because gala uh, burn is like a different meaning compared to like crypto yeah, normal okay. burn yeah, not talking about tokens, talking about the NFTs. So yes, the they, NFTs. Yeah, yeah. So I'm, I do think that the, the NFTs are going to be burned. But I still can. Because we don't have a cap right now for the amount of heroes. That's okay. Just because people can merge. So we need to balance the amount of heroes. For example, if a lot of people merge, they're going to be like more legendaries than previously minted. So this is part of the process too. Yes. Let's see, Crypto we have Bezum in. the future of Kala. Bezumis' question is: Will my progress on my character and HP level be saved when the game goes live? So currently, Bezumir, the only thing that is being kept is your character level. With the character level, you get your skill tree and your talents because they are linked to your level. Mastery scrap and your HQ level might reset. That is not guaranteed to be kept. The only thing right now is HQ levels. True. And we are going to have this XP level, the XP and the level saving in the NFT metadata really soon. Really, really soon. Not going to give the date, but at like days. Yeah. Nice, nice. Hey, thank you, Bitbender, for raiding 161 people over on Twitch. Let's go. He's learning how oh, to do things. It's right good now. to see. Jeez. Yeah. We're doing What's up, Tofu, good. by the way? Tofu in the chat. Man, why can't we see what? the like icons? How much likes we get, Paul? <laughs> I want to see that number go up real time. No, it's all good, though. I'm still trying to find you guys. Tofu, comment a little yeah, which... bit about burn. Yeah, how I say, uh, I still think they're going to be like the NFT is going to be burned, but of course, we still need to check this. Mm -hmm. so... We have a question from Tiango. Is there any, me uh, any mechanic in mind to pass experience from one NFT to a new one bull? I guess that's for Doug. Right now, <coughs> sorry. Right now, I don't think so. Um, I don't know if he, let's see, Thiago Silva is talking about like a mechanic like we do have in Champions Arena, that uh, they can swap experience yep, between something heroes. similar. Yeah, something similar. I don't think right now they're going to ha have something like that because the whole idea is to, to get your hero, work a lot of the hero. We do have like, we don't have... It's not public yet, but we're gonna 
have like the the premium features maybe a little bit of the premium features maybe gonna have like a boost for xp gain for a specific amount of time this is a working process that they're they're gonna announce soon so this is oh, very cool. good i'm yeah. looking forward to that Hey, yeah, which guys are you? Which uh, which zone are you guys in? We are currently in M thirty. Next to Bitbender. Where are you guys hanging out? Yeah, I don't think Bitbender is on anymore. His I think he yeah. logged out. Yeah, yeah, he, he went off offline. Off. Right? You normally raid over on Twitch when you go offline, so you carry the viewers over to the next stream. So he's probably yeah. offline. So we can do another event if any of you guys have anything in mind. Yeah, I don't think I think he heard us say us. that we wanted to kill him, and he just decided to be so. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh, they're bringing like, everybody nah. hey, There's somebody. There's somebody in P thirty or help base. Oh, you're you're, you're out of no robot, ro robotty, Dylan. Can, you, can you repeat, this. Dylan? Oh. All right. Still sounding crazy. P thirty three. Okay, I will make my way there. Where? P thirty three. Okay. Oh, uh, I am in the best way. Then the you can just teleport to my base. Oh, yeah. I'm in thirty four, and then you just go up one. I am yeah, not in to, alliance. Come to P thirty three, tiny. Come find me, so you could lead me to the rest of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you? Are you already in P33? Yeah, I'm in P33. I don't know if Dylan was mentioning me, but I'm I'm here chilling in P33. Uh, I'm in, there's um, a message here in chat from Denda Day Gaming uh, saying uh, hello to J Home. Oh, what's up? Let me see. Who said what's good? Yeah, they're in the YouTube. Dende. Oh, Dende, Dende Day Gaming. You guys already know what's good. Shout out to the community um good to be here i uh i honestly missed kind of like the minecraft streams we used to do where we're all just in here hanging out so glad we're gonna be able to do that in the walking dead for sure good to have smiling monster in here you know <laughs> you know <laughs> hey those minecraft streams were lit weren't they you remember uh yep. remember our boy ed just like uh living basically in there just <laughs> I, I heard he's still in there to that very very uh very to this very day legend says so uh, but it's, it's I remember Ispra's, Ispra's event. Jay Hoon would randomly come up behind you and hit you off the edge. I almost died <laughs> twice. You killed me a couple of times, bro. So <laughs> yeah, because you almost good. killed me twice. You, so I was like, I, I need did, to teach you I, a lesson. Did I kill you though? Did I ever? No. Kill you? No. So if you there's know, a problem, you, gonna, you get rid of it before it. The just, man, that's crazy. You know that was. But uh, but like I said, good to, good to see you here, Smiling Monster um yeah and how like how how long have you been into gala i know you make a lot i've been popping into some of your Oof. streams which are great by the way but uh like what made you interested in kind of getting into gala uh i've joined gala 2021 like mid 2021 bull run because oh, i just cool. started going down my crypto journey and okay. then i experienced like you know the whole journey where you research bitcoin and then exchanges DeFi, then getting scammed fished rugged all of that and i was like maybe crypto is not for me you know and then i discovered nfts and i was confused by why people would pay the amount they pay for like pictures of monkeys and like a rock or like a penguin or whatever yeah. and then i discovered nft gaming and it just clicked you know when you get the light bulb moment it goes like everything just rushes like oh nfts and gaming and like legendary weapons can become nfts and you can trade and then your yeah. time can be traded and this and that and i was like oh this makes complete sense so then I went to, I think it was Coin Market Cap or Coin Gecko, and they had a new section called Metaverse. And then Gala was on that page. And I was like, oh, what is this? And then I went down the Gala rabbit hole. And I was like, yep, this is this is something I'm interested in. And I believe the first ever NFT I bought was a Miranda Allsight Elf. And I have it till this day. I don't Heck plan yeah. to get rid of it. No, yep. I represent Miranda's. Yeah, that's good. Yep. Yeah. It's, it's the game. game. It's the game. Brand is for sure like that's that's gonna be fun for us all to get into the mix as well to play but uh that's really interesting yeah no nah, once again you know always been good energy smiling monster um definitely when we've been ramping up these streams you've been just really active within the community um you know you yeah. tofu spira like shout out to shout out to the gang see money um general kaizen 
Definitely just shout out to all the people who've been really active and you know, we're doing, we're doing pretty good, right? Like we got what 65 live viewers from what I've seen right now in the YouTube. Um, and I don't know. Wow. We got over a hundred including Twitch. So everyone, you know, everyone who's watching this stream, I, I want to see that like button go up. Oh, but it sucks because I can't even see it right now. We need to change that. Don't worry, but, I can uh, see it for you, Jay Hoon. That's my boy, you know, <laughs> definitely. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's, uh, everyone hit that like button. Let's, uh, uh, you know, share it with your friends, go to your neighbor's house, knock on the door, um, you know, get them on, get them on the stream as well. Uh, as, as you guys already know, we grow together as a community. So, um, yeah, once again, it's, it's good to have everybody in the mix. Um, but yeah, Taco, how you been, man? You know, I, I haven't talked to you in a while, man. How's, uh, how's life been for you, man? I, I've been good. Um, Doug said that uh, you have a really sad headquarters in here. You're only level three, and we need to hop in here and help you level that up. <laughs> so I, I thought I'd, I thought I'd come through. I just teleported over. It's, it's just like a it's just a flag, and you're dead, and that's <laughs> no. all you got going over here. No, don't look at what I got going. Now I'm trying to find you guys. I'm here wandering. Yeah, I still uh, I got to get more into the mix. Um, definitely want to. You can just press G and join Bitbender's Guild. Thank you. That you see, I just need concrete, you know, ways to we, figure this stuff out. I'm only going. <laughs> Are we still so that's, RTS that's gamer? Thing. We're in Bitbender's guild. If you wanna join that guild to teleport for ease of teleport. Oh, nice. We're I am there. running there. Like a normal. Oh, you person. ran there. So do I, leave, do I leave your guild then, Nephilim? Uh <laughs> yeah, I'll, be, I'll, I'll be over there in a sec. Can you guys hear me now? Yeah, yeah finally, bro. Yeah, that was way clear. Where were you saying to, earlier, man? I had, to, I had to move my hotspot. There was a cloud in the way. No, uh, <laughs> no, I'll be over there in just a sec. I was asking where you guys were. Nice, nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking. Got for a you question too. from Sigurd. Will all characters share a base in the future, like the previous playtests? Yeah. This is the kind of thing that is in flux, like. Because we do we we do test a different ways to do that in the last play tests, and this can change. Like it still can be like one side, like each character have their own base and everything separate, and the other side sharing between the heroes that you have. But they're still being decided. There's another question there that I saw, the, like asking when skins, and I do want. Yes. I, I'm one of the person that I really want skins in a game, like from different weapons and different things for the yes. characters, for the heroes. When I think right now, because we are so close to the end of the year, there's like almost 30 days to the end of 2023, skins only next year. So this is a thing that's gonna take time. But the question is, it's not off the table, right? There could be skins in the future. Oh no, yes, yes. They they talk a little okay. bit about very good. I think it's more well, a yes than no, because there's already a... all that. we're going to do that, but not now. Well, remember that, uh, Smiling, I think you were there. Remember when there was that golden crossbow thing that we did with the content creator? Yes. So technically, technically, there's already a skin. It's there's a weapon skin. You know, yes. So, yeah. It's a good precedent. It's a good precedent. <laughs> I think there's several ways you could have skins. You could do like PvP to get points to get skins. You can have it in the premium uh, gold shop as well. That uh, people that don't want to PvP, they have the option to buy it. And if people want to PvP, they can get like custom PvP skins. I've got so many ideas. That'll yeah, sound dark. I, I, I propose it. You know, I'll keep talking. I think we can have like skins that are specific for a hero rarity, you know? Mm, yeah, Ooh, like interesting. A, yeah, for example, you have like a, a Daryl, ancient Daryl. So maybe there's a a skin that only works for ancient Daryls. That's kind of a way to have like a different. But it should also be that you can have a common Daryl skin and like you can progress that skin to go to the ancient Daryl. Because some mm, people yeah. don't like it when, um, well, cosmetics is fine, but generally you should be able to build your way up to the ancient rarity by putting in time. And you buy the ancient to bypass some of the grind. Yeah, it's all about, it's all about if the skins are only only gonna be like a cosmetic, like a like a cloak, like changing clothes for the heroes. Mm. 
but maybe we do have like special things and etc maybe like a like, special outfit that the hero uses just in line this second season you know this kind of stuff interesting need like a, a daryl in a ghillie suit and stuff like that that'd be super cool like actually blends in with the environment and yeah yeah no, that would... and then we we can it's... have also because for example it's not a spoiler but the commonwealth the last season seasons mm. like for example their work there for the commonwealth and did use it the 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 armor like the white armor there so I would love it if you could like to uh, like switch between the armor you wear and your character model because I would love to see my ancient Darwin like all riot gear with like a gas mask and then like the the brass knuckles that would look awesome. And I just I was traveling, like of course running, and I just get trapped inside the. Yeah. So when is the base fix? Everybody has been asking when is the corner base fix. Yeah. And the base, the base. Here's what I think. Here's what I think about the base fix. Wow. I think the base fix what? is called an igniter. I think if enough of us just light <laughs> up every base that's burning, right, I'm, I'm just telling you, I'm petty, guys. If so, if I get trapped in a base, you can guarantee I'm dropping what I'm doing. I'm finding an <laughs> igniter and I'm gonna torch that base to the ground. I just, just got stuck. Saying. Can you torch this base? I just finally made it to P33. Every time I come to P33. Yeah. It's so hard. Yeah, to there's people. there's some in the corner that always teleport you in to that uh, person's base. It's when they build walls outside and then they have the middle center, like no floor or no um, display items. So that yeah. tells the game that, oh, this zone is clear for you to teleport into, but you're surrounded by walls on the border. So it's based on wooden floors on your actual base. On my testing. Yeah. I open, thought... open concept floor plans, guys. That's the way to yeah. do it. Hey modern hq we have a question from kissa tv uh about land if i just quickly scroll up let's answer my question about land i think the question what is about was the point of owning land, land? yes yeah. like you can use one land but is there going to be benefits to owning more land in the future and will you be able to upgrade land or is it just going to be like set rarity Upgrade, it's a different thing because some people got confused when if you say something like upgrade because then they think that we are being able to increase the the rarity, not the case mm. for lands. Uh, but of course, like different upgrades for the land or for the base are possible. And I think the question also uh, inquired about owning more than one piece of land, more, more than one land did. And when we implement the reward system, a lot of the rewards are going to be tied to the land ownership and only more land equals more rewards. This is a right. Is it in that mm -hmm. same zone or all across the, the county? No, it, it doesn't matter because like maybe all going to be like different pools of rewards. So there's like a, a pool for the commons, a pool for the ancients, you know, different ones. And but of course, your land need to be uh, have some kind of activity. People need to live there, key walkers, this kind of stuff. If if the land is totally abandoned, it's not gonna generate rewards. Makes sense. I'm guessing that's where the land share section come into play. When you check the NFT description, it says this, uh, like say common has like uh, 30 land shares and like ancient has like 3000 land shares. So I'm guessing that's what's going to yeah. be in play when you have activity on your land. Mm -hmm. I have a question. Sure, from anyone. Sure, your please. favorite sure. person, Tiny, keeps killing you in PvP. He says, what about renown in game? Like what is renown? When is it going to be in game? And what does it do? Uh, this I think I'm gonna let let's wait for the next AMA for that because then we're gonna That's this is chance. connected with the leaderboard and other things. Sheesh. And sounds interesting. Yo guys, so I'm still like, how do I teleport? <laughs> I've been still. <laughs> I joined. I joined the guild and I I, I pressed teleport and it, it 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 brought me to like my level three little flag. 
Uh, so when you I, teleport, you check the, the blue bar to make sure it says not returning home. Because if it says returning home, even yeah. if you select your alliance member, it will teleport you back to your base. You have to make sure it says teleporting to alliance HQ. So if that's an issue, you might have to walk here. Or we can go somewhere else. What's the plan? I'm are we P going to... I'm in P33. Are we going to P33? I'm in P33. Can... Okay, Where are let's... you, Tiny? Are you in P33? What's your coordinates? I am in M33 at the moment because mm. I got trapped in P33. Someone's base was on the road. I thought the roads were safe to, like, you know, get into yeah. P33. It's not. You can just Why? teleport if you're in Bitbender's Guild. You can just press G. And then if you look for my name, Smiling Monster, my base I is in... Not bitbenders oh, yeah. okay i'm gonna it's I'm for gonna... jayhoon mainly yeah <laughs> or anybody else and doug as well but you can just Appreciate teleport to my that. base and head I've over been, like this whole time just okay. looking for you guys it's mine yeah i'm going to your base man. i'm gonna find you guys i would appreciate some help i'm in n33 now i'm almost um, to... oh, oh nft yeah. chuck says when when neff in pvp yeah that sounds like a challenge nephilim you gonna you ne gonna let him what talk the... to you like that man i mean why are you singling me out he said, he said that. He's, yeah. he's said killed that. everybody else. He's yeah, killed Tiny. Yeah, he's that's killed true. Doug. Oh, Doug. Uh, he's adding names times. to his list. I think it's true. Yeah. How I think strong are you now? Already... I'm curious of how many how many masteries you've made. How many people have you actually killed? What is your body count? <laughs> Whoa, those are the real question. Question. <laughs> Chuck, all I'm, Chuck, all I'm going to say is I'm going to show up in <laughs> PvP one of these days when you least expect it. And I'm gonna kill you, and then I'm gonna leave and never enter PvP Whoa. zone again. <laughs> Yo, Netflix game a trophy. And NFT Netflix Chuck killed. Because like even in the Minecraft, like Netflix built like a whole secret room underneath. I don't know. That was crazy. You know, definitely. Oh. If you if you make this uh, Walking Dead a bit more moddable, he, he's gonna take over the whole server. <laughs> you know, <laughs> no, Netflix. Mods in the MMO RPG? That would be an interesting way. That would be an interesting, but uh, all right, Doug, I'm just following you, okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to the, the diagonal to P33. I'm jumping to Smiling's base right now, so I'll be there in a second. I'm rocking my. Can someone shadow. tell me if nice the road is safe to come into P33? Can from you which direction? Walk around zombies. I am what coming from N, so M M. N, N, N. Because you're not in the corner side. The corner is safe? The... No, not the corners aren't safe. Go to like one screen away from the corners and then move all the way in as far as you can go and then teleport. You can make it safely away from here, this road. Oh, and if they no, just, just say the challenge. Oh, I have one more zone to cross. One more zone to cross. If you guys are interested, you can experience a level 59 base upgrade. And if Tichaka said, if you want to see how well you can do, he can level up his base. He's got everything ready. And okay. you can we can see if you want to do a level 59 base upgrade. Right. Or we Let's can do it. Where, where level is... four base yeah, where? upgrade. I think that sounds like a better idea. <laughs> you know? I mean, if, we do, if, if we do a where level four base upgrade, it's going to be done in like five seconds. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So where Up are to you level go? six, I you should be fine. Is an N34? Yeah. N34, he said. Hey, Doug, time. be the homie and give me some items, yeah? Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey! I, I was, I was I dying there. I was... I got your back, see? Oh, I I, I, yeah. I took the damage for you, bro. So where do you need to go? Where's the place? I'm just following you. Let's see. Are we are we Who going to go? the track or, or else? Well we're near Jay Hoon's base, so why don't we go help him get a few levels on his base? And oh, if you guys so feel nice like you. doing Jeez, the upgrade, if you feel like going for a challenge, we can do Chuck's base in like 10, 15 minutes. Oh, that's so nice yeah, of you. All right. All right. So where's Please where's Jayhoon's Doug. base? Where's Jayhoon's base? Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, Did you just go to Smiling Monsters? <laughs> yeah, I was, I'm in Smiling Monsters. Actually, one of my 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 Maggie is right beside Smiling's base, so I didn't oh. realize I didn't realize we were neighbors, man. Hey, your neighbors with my clan. I think Jayhoon's in P33, oh. correct? So if you just go to yeah. my base and then head south, it should take you right to his uh, zone. South. From one, please show me the way. Oh, show me the way of safe. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
The, there's a... Let me hear a bit here. Laranjeira is saying, ah, I think the teleportation should not exist because it's against logic. Things are mo moving too far away and etc. But if necessary, it should be char charging that coin or gala. That, that's a suggestion. And mm, Interesting suggestion. I mean, zombies yeah. are probably not... <laughs> I... <laughs> no, that's yeah. good charge. It depends but, uh, on yeah, the setup of the game. Because if you had, like, local marketplaces and local auction houses or, like, city centers are local and trade is actually meaningful, like moving items from one city center to another, then teleportation should have a cost to it. But if you're having it global, then teleporting is fine because there's no value transferred when you teleport. Like, right now, you can teleport with items, bandages, weapons, and you can teleport to your guildmates and all that, and that's a good way to get community going. But once like an economy comes into the game, that can be an issue because a lot of people will abuse the teleportation um, feature and turn it yeah. into a mechanic to get, I wouldn't say oh. get a benefit. Let's put it at that. And there are, uh, oh, j -Hon, be careful with the wolves. There. I know, I'm running, I'm running. You're going to jump, jump. Back, dog. Other... Okay, what are the coordinates for j -Hon's base? I don't yeah, even know. Well, I, about I teleport. <laughs> I do know that uh, because right now we are playing in just 10% of the game, just one county. And in the end game, we're going to have 10 counties with the 810 zones. And I do know that the devs plan plan to... So, for example, it's going to be like teleportation between the city centers. There is going to be one way to do. So, like, you go to a city center and then you can teleport to a whole different county. Hmm. Yeah, so I'm guessing this mechanic is just for the playtest, so people can actually yeah. play together. But yeah. in one of the AMAs, you did say city centers will be the main hubs. That's where the marketplace would be. That's where teleportations and factions will be. And you said you might get like items, for example, motorcycles, which use gasoline. You won't be able to ride them in game, but you will be able to use them as a point of travel. Yeah, there are a few surprises too that they're they're gonna add in the future. Don't want to spoil. But they, they do have like some. Okay, let's see what I can say or not say. Like first time user experience, you know, when you join the game, it's gonna be like different things to do. Maybe gonna find like a place, maybe a helicopter. Gonna be like different things that to so you learn about even teleportation, this kind of stuff, different mechanics, and this is important because. We need to separate. Like there are a lot of things that we do right, we do have right now that are only in the game, like this, just because we're playing a small version of the game, in a public yes. development build. Mm -hmm. Different mechanics are gonna be needed to be implemented when the game is fully launched. So, what are you guys next to? Uh, hey guys, I. I, got, I gotta give a quick shout out i'm in i just hopped into uh p33 i see you smiling but i just mm -hmm. jumped into spike jim's base and i gotta let you know i would have been stuck except he was a gentleman and he left his back door open so i could wow. walk right out isn't that awesome shout out That's to him. shout out to him man we had sent an announcement team player. in most of the discords like leave one square open if your base is in a section like in a corner I yeah. think uh, the Walking Dead officers in the Gem Guild have told everybody, like, it's annoying when you get stuck, so think what people are going to be when they get into your base. Just leave a section free. Yep, I think yeah. most people have done that. That's yeah, awesome. Where are you, Jay Hoon? I'm in P33. I'm, I'm with Doug and Taco. What's good, Taco, yeah. by the way? You know, you guys tell us know. To meeting up with the crew. I don't think he's even, here, we're, we're at Jorik's base. We need to go up a whole other thing. Oh, Jorik. This is Jorik's base. Yeah, oh, yeah, we're not yeah. even in the right quad. All right, Taco, right. lead the way, man. We'll follow you. We're well, going uh, to Jay Hoon's base. I'm going right? to follow you to your you own base. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> I appreciate are you. In you. Here? Can you find me? <laughs> I am currently at P33 minus 35 minus 74. So if we yeah, gather bro. there and then we can move, minus like follow Jay Hoon's train. I'm at let's the go, shop. Go. Is that close? At the shop? Okay, let's go to. The the shop icon. By the way, Netflix, you, you should icon. you should keep shouting out the community, man. You know, felt like uh people were thankful for the shout out. So, so twelve thirty. Yeah. Let's get let's get like ten more shout outs just randomly from the community. More shout outs. More mm. shout outs, bro. Who shout do we shout out this week? 
who who's been really cool Chuck? in the gala gold discord and just i don't know NFT just just Chuck. a community shout out to player. nft chucks and all the deaths he gives us <laughs> no 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 don't shout out him don't shout out that guy <laughs> he already he already he already got a shout out in, uh, in the last ahead of the game by the way if you didn't watch the head of the game for thanksgiving go watch it there were people that we shout out and didn't even know it exactly. go watch, go watch i got stream, three guys. shout outs go which was yeah, pretty good did. That's shout, out shout out to Smiling Monster today for joining us. That's four. Yeah. Oh yeah, shout out to Smiling Monster. Oh, General Hyman. Yeah. I'm making large. Large says, okay. shout out. <laughs> but yeah, Dylan, any more shout outs? Anyone been um mm. even even to the trolley members of our community? You know, any interesting things happening in Galagol Discord? You feel like worth mentioning? Mm anything interesting to be honest i haven't been looking at gala gold today as much i was busy on some other stuff uh let me see mr a dude, shout out to him for he's a he's a fellow lord of the rings fan a big fan of lord of the rings and i think he pulled a uh he got a sick pull what was it like uh i think he got an ancient um, eternal paradox uh, a mercenary he was like i think on his fifth box or something he got super lucky so shout out to him uh and his uh his mint one ancient, uh, I think it was a Bianca. Uh, let's see. Who else is kicking butt? Wait, wow, what General Kaizen? Why are you saying no shout outs, bro? No, <laughs> no shout outs. <laughs> Look at General Kaizen trying to be a hater. Hey, come in the game, General Kaizen. What you doing, man? RNG Crypto says he got zero shout out to RNG Crypto. If you follow Gala Music, he's one of the people to go to. He covers Gala Music. Hey, I man, get my info from 8 bit attendees and. <laughs> No shadows for <laughs> RNG Crypto. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nah, there's this a is no shout out to RNG you. Crypto, man. Holding it down in the community. Uh, oh, but I lost you, Taco. My guy. I was like looking. Oh, there you are. Thank you, Taco. That's you, so you, nice. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like lost you. I, just I, I, I thought you were up here on the border over here, but now I don't see your base. It's hard to find because it's just that hey, one Johnny, flagpole. Where's where yeah. your location? <laughs> Oh, are you at the shop? Yeah, definitely hard to find the flag. Oh, what's up, RNG Crypt? I'm in P33 at the shop. I Where's started following Doug NFT at? Chuck because I didn't want to stand here anymore. <laughs> Doug, how'd you, how, why do you abandon us, man? Lucifer bought well, some Doug's wolves. in the zone north of you guys. If he just heads south, he should be there. I tried to oh, okay. teleport to Jehoon's base and I got teleported back to my base. So I'm running two zones. Uh, I mean, oh, technically, no. I can teleport to my own base, right? Now that I think about it. Yeah. Yeah, you just press O. Oh. Yeah, and then you but then the people the following hit. you will get lost. Oh, well. Sorry, Taco. I'll see you, I'll see you on the other side. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I have a gift for you. I, I believe you guys. But start either way, where are you? Start guys? collecting wood. Okay, I will. I'm I'm a, I'm at Jayhoon's base. I'm ready. I don't know what you guys are yeah, talking about. Hey! Now I, now Can I can't tell find us the it. I'm on my way. Yeah, I'll I'll go back there. Hold on, I was killing something. Who, who is this dude? Hanamichi. What's up, Hanamichi? How did you end up in my base? You, what you what you on my base for, bro? It's my space. He's oh, hanging Neff. out. He's waiting. <laughs> it's the What's homie Nephilim. Rocking the show. You already know. Okay. Let's All right, go. so go to oh hold on, it's in Q thirty two at minus eighty ninety nine. So. Q thirty two. Q thirty two. Yeah, it's in Q thirty two. Q thirty three. Yeah, he told us the wrong everything. It's Q. What? Where are you? Q thirty two. Oh my god, Jay, who's just messing with us right Jay, now? Come on, figure it out, right guys. Come on, you guys should have you been all in Q thirty three. Okay. It's hard enough to get to P33. P33 is like a trap for everybody. Yeah, is not what you mean? You can just walk around zombies, Tiny. What are you talking about? I've never had a problem. Not when you get trapped zombie. in a base, then you have to start traveling again. I guess. Well, the yep. corner, the corner between Q32 and P33 is safe, so you can hop corners. I right, safe. Cool. Man, yeah. God, safe? Definitely. Okay. I'm going yep, to use the I'm corner. The I will always follow Nephilim in games because during the Minecraft series, he like he hooked me up with some pretty cool items. So hopefully you do the same <laughs> this time, Nephilim. <laughs> you know? ah! He was trying to kill me. Oh, I just took your stuff. My bad. <laughs> no, you're good. You're good. I'm just I'm just grinding XP. What's up? This, this stag over here. What's up, I feel man? bad. A bunch That's of people just man. found me in P33 and I teleported away. <laughs> Sorry, NFT chat. Tiny abandoning people. 
I did. Oh, but, Crypto you know, Genie we... asked, will there be an actual story like levels and bosses like Diablo or something like <coughs> just loot and build? That's an interesting question. Hmm. Yeah, it would be similar nothing... to the show. Yeah, no, nothing uh, RPG oh, style. But I think gonna be like different missions. And we we are going to have like different factions in a game. This is gonna give like a sense of the yeah. Not a story, but of life too. That's why you guys gotta join the streams. You know, we can we can make a story together, like we we're kind of doing for Minecraft, right? Like we could really role play. Like ima imagine Taco. This is re reality. What? How? How is your reaction? <laughs> you're in a you're in an apocalyptic world. What's your first re uh, reaction thought that comes to your mind? I guess my first thought is we should probably help you with your base because you're going to die out here, man. <laughs> Whatever. Stop oh, hating, no man. Oh, no way. Stop <laughs> hating. It's okay. You're, look at this level one base at least, you know? At least I'm le at least my flag has a three I have on arrived. It. Bro, click that level up button. Let's get moving. Yeah, I'm here too. Let's, let's power I almost wanted yep. to start journeying to one. NFT yeah, we... Chuck base to do his level 59. Yep. Because Let's by do a the couple time you guys start, here. Yeah. Yep. you guys will be done by the time I guys I get CJ Hoon's base because I went to the wrong and spot. It's gonna be an awesome yeah, experience, experience doing it, that but... 59 upgrade. You guys are gonna be <laughs> dying all over the place. Whoa, I got yeah, a bunch gonna, of homies with me. Hey, what's good I'm everyone? Gonna head are to going? are they there? Or should I there go to Q32? Yeah, that's where we're at. We're, we're we currently got at Q32, yeah. minus 77, 92. And we have, like, so many people. We could handle, we could handle like, the next 30 upgrades with no issue yeah. here. So. Oh, really? That's, that's, that's so great. nice of you guys. Jay, Jay Hoon's got, <laughs> Jay Hoon, you're going to run out of resources, yeah, before yeah. we can ever do that. So uh, Hit that great, Jay Hoon. Yeah, hit upgrade. I <gasps> how do I, how do I, so I press, press You press it. H, press H, oh, H, and it'll bring up your bait menu, and then at the bottom, there's an upgrade. Uh, button it says upgrade <laughs> unavailable i think i need some metal okay hold on <laughs> this is the same shit with minecraft Dude, take i just this. i was just take running this. around this whole time oh my take man take that metal it's real weird, that. uh, that's why i, I also you, do Deborah. agree that's why i follow you pvp follow is you the anywhere. only thing to go <laughs> i will follow you to the... oh, cool i just upgraded it all right guys i believe in you guys i'm gonna just <laughs> Take it in the middle here, you know? Okay, let's go. Dang, we got a bunch of people. This is actually dope. All right, let me try not to die. I don't think you're going to die. There's going to be like six <laughs> zombies right now. Well, you should make sure not to die, because if you do die, the upgrade automatically fails. Okay, let me just That's true. This That's a that fact. People. I'm going to just stay out the way. I don't even got a good weapon, honestly. <laughs> I'll let you guys hit. Oh, look at this dude, one. He's just giving me stuff, but it won't let me So, Kissa, to answer your question, the marketplace there will be like a app store when the game goes to mobile and the currency used to pay for that would be gold because there's going to be a three currency system scrap is the in-game currency gold will be the premium currency and then dead coin will be the reward currency sorry continue guys i'm just in the habit Why of answering questions <laughs> you might want to move off the resource jayhoon because when you're on the resource it doesn't give you the option to grab it so move off and you should see a little hand and then press that hand and you pick it up Hey, people are taking my stuff. All right, that upgrade's done. Let's hit another one. All yeah, right, next I got one. You guys. If you but guys do have resources, you can just click on Jay Hoon's chest and you can deposit into the chest. You don't have to drop it. Yeah. So nice of you guys. Wow, you guys are so That's nice. Only if you're the, his in, ally, in his alliance. Yes, that is true. Okay, so sorry. Can you give me the coordinates one more time? Negative seventy-seven and what? Uh, 95 yeah yeah if you're in the alliance with vent it you can teleport to his it's right next door i am yeah, not okay hey all right shout outs lou cyphers here tacos here oh, and amici's here shout out to Iron man hey hey there's rng crypto i wonder thoros here and Herm, the way you play this game is you go to TWEEmpires.com and then you can download the game there. It's also working on the Gala Game Store. You just have to install it. It's currently free to play. 
install it through the Gala website or the Walking Dead website. And then you can just log in to the game, link your account. If you have NFTs, make sure the NFTs are over on Gala chain to be able to keep your progress and to show up in the game. And then you can just press play with whichever character you want to play the game with. That's what's up, Smiley Monster. And also, guys, actually press that link in that, uh, in, um, where, where is it, Paul? The pin, pin comment, I'm guessing. So it's in the description, pin comment. Um, definitely press that link so we can just, yeah, come join the game. That's how you join the game. So come through. Thank you once again, Smiling Monster. You hold, uh, appreciate you holding it down, my man. You got a very got suited, suited voice, man. You know? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> we got answer over on Twitch as well. Hi, guys. Yeah, what can stop you do? Stop flirting with, with you know, I'm not flirting with no one. I'm being, I'm being genuinely honest, you know? I, I, you know, it's a cool voice you got there, man. But uh, damn, we got like 15 people just mobilized helping me with this base. All right, let me let me do the yeah. next upgrade. Dang, you now, you also have a really pretty voice. Oh, Don't worry, thanks, man. Taco. Hey. <laughs> God, real thanks, wholesome Taco. here. <laughs> and a good. I noticed all Gala community members have like fancy epic beards, so I'm I'm in the process of growing mine. I'll get it big, <laughs> like big enough one day. Yeah, yeah, I've been trying, but I can't, you know. I can't go over here. Not with that Let's go over to Turkey. We can get the the transplants instead of on the head. We go for the beards. Transplants? Let's go get it. I'm down. Yeah, That's yeah, beard transplants, too, man. You know? That would be fun. That'd be great content. That would be great. All right, content. I got some more metal, Jehu. I'm gonna throw it on the ground yeah. for you. Yes, sir. I'm just picking right up. Your <laughs> There's a question from Eduardo Braga. Hey, Eduardo. Uh, Asking if, if we are going to receive scrap, someone craft something in my NFT workbench. Uh, rewards are going to be connected with land ownership and also crafting stations. So people using your crafting stations are going to receive rewards. So if there's going to be like scrap or other yeah, things, it will be, need to be decided. More right. details that I'm going to have in the next MA. This is the first stop. In one of the previous AMAs, you said you won't be able to merge your crafting stations, but you might be able to upgrade your crafting stations. Is that yeah. with dead coin or rarity or just level? Because I'm interested in that. Uh, this is a thing that mm. still need. They're still working on that, but it's tied, I think, with our three tier, like three current system with scrap, mm. gold, and dead coin. So. We're gonna hit another upgrade, Jehu. Upgrade, but not hit that upgrade. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Appreciate you, man. Man, I feel like my job is the hardest. You know, I gotta. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are just like you know, killing the zombies. I gotta press this button that says upgrade. It's pretty, pretty Walkers. hard work, guys. So, just want to let you know. <laughs> nah, I'm messing with you guys. So I want a better question. Uh, Tsuga says, do I pay scrap if I'm using my own station or do you, will there be options to like set tiers? For example, if you have your alliance using your station, then you have like a random person using your station and then will you be able to add like names and then those gets like alliance discounts? Will that be happening in the future? They talk about that, about having like different scenarios where there's a different charge for people that from your alliance or for everyone else gonna be done by permissions in the crafting station setup settings so nice. that's also the possibility but also we need to remind that the scrap cost of like any item in game is related to the cost to craft that is not like always like only like a thing that's paying the crafting station but it's the cost of the item to, to prepare like in real life now like you need glue you need stuff you need boats and etc so this is the connection with scrap interesting okay oh, I need more guys we, that's what we should do that's what we should do sometime is we should get a bunch of people with level one uh characters to all just build their hqs at the same time activate like 10 level one eight upgrades oh. and like 10 level two We've upgrades done that. wouldn't that be it fun it was so fun we did three level like 50 upgrades. I think it was Chuck Luz and somebody else's. They all went live at the same time. And all you oh, see is just word. red dots appear on your screen and zombies That's and gunfire crazy. and explosions everywhere. It's a cool thing. Oh, we should man. definitely do that. Hey, I yeah, need some stone guys, it. by the way, in order to get- Yeah, if you're, watch, if you're watching the stream right now and you uh, you have a level one base, get over here and drop it on the ground. We'll, we'll upgrade it. 
Hey, that's tight. Oh, yeah, and RNG Crypto, I am definitely getting the treatment right now. Hey, actually, you know, just on some genuine or just some uh, real stuff, uh, I appreciate everyone here holding it down. Um, but I do need some stone in order to get to the next uh, level. <laughs> 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 you know? Jeez, uh, it's, it's never just a compliment. It's always a compliment <laughs> with, uh, <laughs> with the request. Yeah. Well, that's how you do it. Yeah. Ah, man, you know, first, and then the compliments. request. What are you talking about? Yeah, but real okay, talk, guys. I need stone. Eight, 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 eight more. <laughs> hey, okay. but this is really Hi, fun. Hi. I like hanging out with everyone here. Got nickel. All right, there you go. Them. There's your There's your stone. Hit that Appreciate hit that upgrade you. button. So how many smash of you have that made upgrade it button leaderboard. just like you smash the like and subscribe? Yay. Okay. I think I'm ranked 20 on the leaderboards because I've been making content so I don't have enough time to grind as much as I used to. It's oh, like balancing man, playing the game and making that. videos. I'm like, oh I need to make a video, but I want to play the game. <laughs> What's that humble brag? Oh, I'm only level yeah. 20. I'm only like rank 20 because I don't have enough time. <laughs> I was rank seven before I started no. uploading videos again. No, no, no. You've been you've been going at it hard, man. That's awesome. Look at this dude, number one, just running around in a circle. Yeah, he's dancing now. This is dancing. Thank you, dancing. I've never bro. seen so many blue dots on my, except for like when we went to the city center. No, we're all mobilizing here. This is this is real fun. I think they're just helping Jehoon upgrade his base, yeah. so then you can go to the fifty-nine base upgrade. Just take the whole crew and experience like a horde of zombies. And I'm, uh, I'm waiting for that. I love the community. Yep. Let's Maybe get Jehoon to ten, because the then he'll be able to move it to an uncommon and then to rare, and then on the way we can go to I think it's Luz or Chucks that have everything ready, and I think it's close too. It's like all <clears> thirty <throat> something. Yeah. But Kissa also has a uh, Kissa TV. Is the gold coin you get on the marketplace or for owning land tradable? So the gold coin is going to be the item you buy. Like if you're in an app like Champions Arena right now, the gems is going to be equivalent to the Walking Dead gold. And the reward currency will be dead coin. And dead coin will be earned various ways through the game. But if you look in the right hand side, you see the events. Currently, it shows scrap. But that should be dead coin whenever that feature goes live. So you can participate in events, you can kill walkers, you can do like faction stuff. There's a whole bunch of things in the works for you to be able to earn. Also, if you have high um, renown on the leaderboard, you also be able to earn dead coin that way. And nice, the nice. hopeful, like the details about that are going to be announced in the future. So we don't have like specific details right now. We still need to wait for the team to, like, amounts and everything else. They're still working on the, like, economy side. The next update, I believe they've said, is going to be Dungeons. And there's an AMA happening soon, so stay tuned for that. Yeah, they're going to announce the AMA dates. It's still this week. I'm just waiting for them to, to set the dates. I'm waiting too. Yeah, I'm Ooh, curious about this one because then we're gonna. The information. Yeah, and, the and I think we're gonna have a lot of more information from things that I saw them working. So that's cool. Run away! Run, run! Oh, the big one, the heavy. I love seeing the explosions. When the walkers fly, maybe. I like the rackles. Yes, hey, I really, we really need to have a mashup video of people who like take a bunch of walkers, blow them up, and just like clip after clip after clip of all these explosions with walkers like the Benny Hill the screen. It's a great idea. Yeah, we got to do that. That'd be the best video. I I just put that on replay and watch it over and over again. <laughs> Oh dang! That's, that's gotta be a thing. Oh, uh, they're they're asking our location. We are in Q thirty two. Yeah. I think I want to slowly make my way to M thirty two. Yep. Oh, Chuck's the uh, the base upgrade will be M thirty two eighty five minus one ten for the fifty nine base. We've got one more level on Jay Hoons to get it to ten, and then he'll be able to change rarities. Yeah. But, nice. uh, what do we need to for the next upgrade here, Jehu? I need so I need two gasolines, 
Um, yes, 32 sir. metals, 140 stone, and 130 wood. Wait, I got metal for you here. I don't have gas, so I don't know. Give oh, wow. Thank you, guys. Oh, by the way, um, 412 says that he is Nickel Fritz in game and TJ in Discord. That would be awesome, Nephilim. So I don't know. I don't know what you said earlier, but uh, shout out to the homie um, 412. Appreciate you being in. Someone the just dropped 24 gasoline for you, so you have enough gasoline now. Just <laughs> so Man. many resources on the floor. <laughs> you guys are so. I feel kind of bad just saying this, but um, I appreciate the community. It's uh, been real fun. Just picking I'm getting stuff the up. VIP premium treatment here, JD. I know, man. It's very nice of you guys. You got Herschel and tacos. Uh, Jayhoon's gonna get all the way to like level sixty and be like, "Wait, how do you how do you collect metal?" <laughs> <laughs> wait, Where taco, do you wait, find wait. metal in this game? <laughs> taco, how, what level was your base again? By the way, just just Nine. so I know. Nine? You're about to pass me. Oh, nice. Okay. Good mm -hmm. to know. I, <laughs> After yeah, all been, that talking <laughs> about I've, my level three base. Bro, I've been oh, doing it. Good. I've been doing it solo. I don't call in a hundred people to help level me up. <laughs> oh, let's you go know what? With Taco. I feel a bit sad for him. You know? Taco. Let's go. Let's go. Taco. You're doing it right. Soloing it is, I think, the best the challenge lone wolf. you can do. Whatever, yes. Tiny. What are you trying to say? I soloed <laughs> some of my 30 levels for my HQ, and it was tough, but it was fun to do by myself. Oh my and God, I was really happy that I, I failed a couple times going to certain levels, but it was worth it knowing that you can do it. You have to actually plan the bear traps and, like, your fences, so you can, yep. like, have defensives one side and then walk around, kill, and then... It's it's a good way to test your base building skills. I tried helping one of one of the things that I was doing in one of my bases. I had a I had an exploder that would spawn, so I would take mm. him down to like one hit and then just keep him in the area, call a wave, and then kite them all over to the exploder. Right? <laughs> I tried helping this guy with this, and I kept I would find an exploder, bring it over nearby, and he'd kill it. And I'm like, no, 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 man, don't kill him. I'd do it again, and he'd kill it. I'm like, dude, stop <laughs> killing this thing. So I just gave up. I'm like, okay, okay. Work harder, not smarter, I guess. I gave up. Oh, wait. I'm following Lucifer. Oh, I don't have space in my inventory. Damn. I, I left... Just things off in your chest. Yeah. I left the party to go to Chuck's base. Okay, so I'm, I'm also joining on the level 59 upgrade. I'm going to go to M32. I think it's one, two, three zones over. Three zones northwest. Nice. Man, I feel so pressured right now, honestly. I just feel bad. You guys all waiting for me while I'm trying to <laughs> Sorry, We're guys. Sorry for the wait. Um, um, what, do you, what do you still need? I just need more stone. Oh, okay. Let's see. We can get some stone. I got it. Uh, I just stone need a hundred, a hundred and thirty more stone. A hundred. Okay. Basically, yeah, basically a hundred twenty now, actually. All right. I left the All party. Right, I'm following Lucifer. He's leading you to the PVP zone, Tiny. It's a trap. No, he wouldn't. We you want the, our backpacks? That's another thing. I think there should be a cooldown timer for when you kill a walker, like 10 seconds, for you to be able to pick up loot. Because currently people could just walk over your loot and all, they get all their scrap and like ammo and the bags. So have like a... It sometimes like a kills swim. you because it grabs the scrap and you're like, I don't need to grab the scrap right now. I'm just trying to live. Yes. Mm -hmm. I saw talk about doing something like that, like the cool, the timers there. Like, just have it so you have, like, a local timer for you or your party if you're in a party for, like, 10 seconds. And then it opens up to everybody being able to loot. Because then it gives you enough time to react. Because you could be killing walkers and then you still have them chasing you. But you won't have enough time to pick up the rewards. So it's just yeah. another little feature that I think would be useful in the game. I'm almost to M32. Yeah, it's a lot of work picking stuff up. <laughs> um, <laughs> all right, well, uh, all right, well, it seems like everyone left. 
Hey, I appreciate you, Taco. You know, hanging out still. You know, everyone. Oh, did everybody uh, leave but me? No, everyone's out getting you resources, man. Oh, oh, you guys are helping get resources. I appreciate that. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you. I was like, I was like, uh, That's how you survive? You band together. I know, Tiny. Taco, Taco, how much stone do you have right now? I've got like fifty. I just Probably dropped off eighteen. That. I don't. You must be. If you have fifty, it's got to be there. Okay. Yeah, I'll be back to yeah. me, and I just followed. You know. What you wow. do? <laughs> That's crazy. And I'm sorry, level ten doesn't need twenty people. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> There's only four of us now. <laughs> it's it's the, yeah, it's the emotional. Like but, but it's, it's all about on. working together and like you know just you know, it's 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 more than that, Tiny. You know. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's all about, it's all yeah. about the moral about, support. If them had room in, in their alliance, I'd probably leave my alliance and go to that one. They're you hear that new NFT chuck? All right. All right. I Make just space need... for tiny. Oh, yes, I did it. All right. Upgrade to level 10. Yeah. There you go. Woo woo. All right. I think in my alliance, there's only like floor. two active people. And... Oh, man. Everyone just keeps <laughs> dropping me stone. This dude named one. Hey, appreciate you, one. Who is one in the chat? I wonder. I wonder if you're. So why wow, you guys know? are killing stuff? All right, I'll just. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you... That, I see you're talking with your, point. with your cool gun. I I got here. Let me see. Can I? Oh, I got a bow. I forgot. I got. Just bow. don't die, Jehu, because then it resets. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'll... You also have to repair the base, so it costs you additional resources. Yeah. Okay, I'll just. Don't I be think... a hero. I appreciate that. But do you have stone <laughs> walls now? Smiling. You know, a nope, stone I still wall. have a level 20 base. I've been focusing on leveling my character. Okay, because I was going to say, do you know how much resources it takes from one stone wall? Yep. Have you tried metal walls? <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's I not tiny. Double Obviously, the stone wall. walls. It's like, oh my god. Oh my god, I just I've got blown up. I'm about to die. Full metal walls. <laughs> I, yeah. I'm on fire. Run. Who blew me up? Hey, Use a bandage. <laughs> oh, okay, no, no, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. That's good. Right, take, guys, take, take this. Take this. I dropped a bandage on the ground. I oh, dropped a bandage. Oh, there on you the go, ground. Tiny. Kayla says right you it. can take his spot in the guild. <laughs> that was hilarious. All right, Stay just stand the there. Don't too. do anything. <laughs> right. I was just trying to help, guys. You know, I saw a cool looking bomb. You know, walk right Guys, what's this? It. What's this blinky thing? It, was just, it just started blinking, you know? How am I not enticed? Chaos Rome says Tiny can take my spot. All right. The NFT Chuck says, that, uh... Buy Chaos. You see, NFT Chuck, hey, you, NFT Chuck, a real one. He uh, being very active in the community. Appreciate you, NFT Chuck. Hey, Neff, you're about to die, bro. Don't die. No, I'm good. I'm good. HB, HB was, is uh, shot, shot the walker. Firewall. Right, we got it. Just... Level 10. Nice job. Yay! Nice. Let's go. Appreciate you guys once again. I will follow you guys and help support anyone who needs their base leveled up now. Um, I think Tiny's over at Lou's base and it looks massive. Oh my god. Okay. Hey, he's one of my neighbors. I'm next door to M31. So. Could have just teleported. <laughs> well, I didn't know. I thought we were going to NFT Chucks, not Lucifer. Oh, that's your base, Johnny. This is not my base. I'm in M31, oh, okay. but uh, I do. I want, like a better weapon. I'm going to come visit more often. Look at all the look at all these goodies. It's an ancient cookery. Oh, nice. Yeah, the broken tables are very cool. Where are right, we're going to M? We're going to M32 next. M32. M32 85 minus 110. It's near the it's southern a corner of the map. Set up for poker here. If you are in Bitbender's Guild, you can just teleport to Bitbender's um, base and then go up to. Okay, I'm teleporting. Oh, they've already started. Incoming zombies. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. RTS Gamer says where we meet now. We are meeting. Um, Smiling Monster just said it, right? It's M3285. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, I died. Already? No. Yeah, it's ancient uh, zombies, so they'll too. 
three hit level 15. Good thing I have all my bandages to save me from dying. I'm going there just to dance around. The zone is there. Hey. Run. So I'm at Bidbender's Brink's um, base. Do I, you said I go you south? Go up. Oh, up. No, I want to go up. Oh, no. Dead to Day Gaming says, I think that's the first time I've seen a base go from 1 to 10 with no walls. That's the power of community, man. You know? That's, that's the power of community. Definitely appreciate you guys. Um, okay. You still at Bitbender's base, Jehoon? I'll lead you to lose base. Oh, yes, please. Thank you. Awesome. Yep, I just teleported over. So Where is the Spira? I, like, I... It would be. Does his spirit has his spirit been in these? No, he has been right. He's been in these, kind of playing the Walking Dead. Spirit's been here. I've seen them in the game. Cool. Follow me. Let's head this way. Yeah, we still got to finish that uh, Minecraft thing he did. <clears throat> that yeah. competition. That yep. was a lot of First fun. First event was definitely fun. Yeah, that was jokes. Oh, thank you. Questions over on Twitch. Anything from YouTube? End of day game, good stuff. Also, Gilbert says, can you earn tokens in this game? So currently, you cannot earn tokens. This is a playtest. But in the future, they will uh, be a token called Deadcoin, and you'll be able to earn it in-game through various activities. Nice. Hey, we, we had 72 view, uh, live viewers in YouTube, by the way. Hey, everybody hit that like button. Well, how much likes are we at, Smiling Monster, right now? Not enough. Yeah, pretty. Oh, wow. Not there enough. you go. What, you what, also what's have. Mine just what's says number? like because I've already liked. Oh, so yeah. it doesn't. It doesn't. Oh, Paul, what ha what happened to the? Why, why can't we see the number anymore? Do we? Do we? You should be there? able to. Yeah. No, no, no. I think it changes depending on how you interact with the. The because, video. Yeah. We uh, also have forty viewers over on Twitch still. So shout out to Ooh. Twitch people. Yeah, someone got to keep nice. an eye on that chat. Oh. <clears throat> I got you. Oh, don't worry. Small and monster. But uh, yeah, definitely appreciate oh. everybody for hanging out. We're at 67. Just imagine each of you brought one more person in. That's 120. You know what I mean, guys? <laughs> you know? Definitely. What if they uh, each brought two people? Oh, you, oh, man, that's blowing my mind. That's 180, you know? That's what we got to get. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, Taco. <laughs> Gotta get these streams up. Anyone know the coordinates in M32? Yep. It's still on the 80 border. 80 minus the 110. Yep, head to the southern corner. Oh. You should see two giant bases, a bunch of people killing walkers all over, exploding all over the screen. They're going to 60. I'm just trying not to die. <laughs> yep, ah. Same. Hey, Jay, hey, hey, be hey, careful. Hey, These are hey, ancient hey, 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 Running around. I'll just pick all these stuff up. Appreciate you. <laughs> <laughs> now you guys can keep holding it. Whoa, there's a lot of people here. This is awesome. Wow. It's a oh, big base here. Died. Why did you leave your backpack? Oh, you died smiling. Shout monster. out to the homies. Hey, shout out to the homies. Man, there's a so bunch heavy. of people here. Who calm? So do you build real communities and can destroy other people's communities? Uh, maybe demand all their stuff? So currently, if you build outside a PvP zone, other people can't attack your base. They can, however, bring exploders and igniters over to set it on fire if you build in a corner and you don't have walls available for them to leave. But um, if you build in a PvP zone, everybody can attack your base, even people in your alliance. They can also interact with your chests and your um, lootable containers if you do place them in the PvP zone. When you do hit a base in the PvP zone, if you look at the top, you have the H icon. It will have a red bar telling you the health of your base, and it will indicate that your base is being attacked. So if you would like to PvP, it's a good idea just to build your base there, and then you can know when somebody's attacking it. And you can uh, participate in PvP that way. But if you do go to PvP zone, Chuck will probably be there. <laughs> Chuck lives there. Chuck. Yeah. Yep. So, are they gonna... Oh, it's still... 
It's still 59, the base here. It's showing 59 it's... to me. Did we they should be going to 60. I saw them coming that they are rich. Just rich at 60. Hey, hey, there's an ancient cookery over here. It's made a five yeah. star yeah. steak. Even if you don't have the levels, you can right click and use it. But when you transfer zones, the HP glitches out and it reduces back to your original HP. If the food gives you a HP buff. Oh, and interesting. Yeah. Thank you, and that, this is a bug. The team is already aware and they're going to fix soon. Uh, who come in PVP zones? Can someone take our crypto? No, they cannot take your crypto because that is should be in your wallet and you haven't signed any smart contracts to allow that. The only thing that you can do when you're fighting in PVP zones is when you die, you drop a bag. Whatever in items are in that bag, they will be able to loot that bag. And if they destroy your base, it just means you have to upgrade it more. It's not full loot PVP. The current things that drop are stackable resources. You keep your bullets, your weapons, and your armor. They reduce durability by 10. I would like it if PVP zones had like full loot PVP. And the current system is for the uh, zones when you doubt outside PVP. I think full loot PVP would be a great idea. Because then it creates demand for weapon crafting, armor crafting, ammo crafting, and it gives like dedicated crafters a like. So if there's a, someone that specializes in crafting sniper rifles, you like oh you go to like for example Hamachi is over here. If you have Hamachi specializes in sniper crafting, it's like oh you need to message Hamachi. He's got like sixty mastery in sniper crafting. You need to get your snipers crafted by him because it will be a better sniper rifle. Nice. Yeah, there's a chance that you're gonna have like maybe. <clears throat> Uh, early, like uh, for first time users, experience like a mild PvP, and then later a full PvP, like you comment about. Well, I did remember or the them saying that there should be a zone where it's just like the wilderness and you can build your bases there and you can fight other people in that zone. I don't know if that's still a plan. Yeah, what are we doing this uh, level level 60 upgrade? Got a whole army here. Uh, here. Jeez. We're all just hanging out. Hey, how do I like upgrade my melee weapons? So you need to upgrade your talents before you can use them. If you press U, switch the tab over to talents. And then if you want to use, say, for example, machete, you need talent level four. So you need to be level 15, no, level five then dump your talent points into melee weapons 4 and that will allow you to use the machete so if you want to use like guns and craft ammo you need to do range weapons and if you want to have higher tier armor you need to put it in gear nice wow so they said they did the 59 level. they just need 30 blocks to get to 60. stone blocks mm. yep wow. i believe it's stone blocks all right let's go get some stone wow Level 50. Uh, you don't have to gather. Somebody's already bringing the materials. So you just got to chill oh, out. Okay. You can answer questions or take a break. Whatever you guys want to do. Should be here in a couple of minutes. All right. So, zomb so zombie or walker apocalypse breaks out and you only have the stuff that's on your desk to, to fend for yourself. What do you use to What do you use to attack the walkers? On your desk right now. What is that? Is that hot sauce? <laughs> no, no, a penguin bar, and then oh, yeah. a digestive's uh, shortbread. These are my weapons. Come get me. Oh, this is what I got. Oh, man, you're no, dead. No, you're so dead. <laughs> yeah, you're. <laughs> got my hands. Like first episodes. No walkers want to. <laughs> I would use um, like my my microphone stand here because it's like a, it's like full metal thing, really heavy. I would yeah. use my cosplay weapon actually. I've cosplayed as like, Trafalgar Law from One Piece, so I've got like a two meter wooden sword custom made. Why? Why is that I not like your first fire. reaction? Why do you grab the digestive biscuits yeah. instead of the cosplay sword? You said in this room. <laughs> okay. Are, are okay. You, fair. Fair. It's are in you that room. By, by this, by this candy that you just showed to us. <laughs> is this, oh, no. this is actually jokes. I got hot no, sauce. No. I've got Enough. jokes. Top of tea, if you want though. penguin jokes, why are penguin shops so busy? 
Doesn't make sense. Because yeah, the fish fillet. Upgrades happening. And I'm going to kill this igniter. Yeah. Oh, I've been helping. I've been helping zombies. Let's go. I'm finally doing something. They're called walkers. What's up? Oh, yeah, walkers. Right. What's up, exploder? <laughs> oh, damn. Homeboy exploding on me. I'm out. Somebody's going to go flying. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Planet Who ball got hit. Eat it up there. It's a guard. No. Oh, no. Oh, they're walkers. Oh, Jay Hoon, like, you're gonna die. Next... Oh. Use a no! bandage. Oh, run, run, run. Ah, uh, wait. So if I die, what happens? Oh, I just. I get head. access to all your loot. Thank you. No! <laughs> Dang. No, we're no. Nah, I have your. Um, oh, well, I'm, I might actually die because there's walkers attacking me. At least I'm back in my little ten days. There's a lot of it no. in the <laughs> Stop trying to grab the scrap. I'm trying to live. I got a lot of your items. I just got a bunch of like mushrooms and stuff. So when you make your way back, I'll drop it to you. Ooh, almost dying. These ancient walkers are no joke. Yeah. Especially if you're like under level 20, they can 2 3 hit you. The variants can pretty much kill you in one hit. If it's the Winslow or the Metalhead. My baseball cap broke. Oh. Uh -oh. I'm doomed. Oh, no. Yeah. <gasps> Tiny died. We did. I oh. ran. I was trying to run away from the explosion and. Oh, that looks pretty epic. But I'll be oh, here. Gold I'll be Tiger's bad. gonna die. Everybody's dying. <laughs> I know how to get. See, this is what you want to see—a level sixty base upgrade. <laughs> Just zombies <laughs> everywhere. Explosions, ragdolls. Hey, there you go. Gold Tiger is my neighbor. Was that it? Did we do it? Hey, it still shows 59. Why yeah. is that? Yeah, trying 59. Did it was 59 die? when he started, no? Did he die? I don't think you died. Oh. Let's see they... they talk there. Let's see. Um... I think they just want you to kill walkers because if you die. They can just continuously do wave 59, which spawns the most yeah. amount of walkers. So they're they just failing on purpose, getting the resources and doing it again. So uh... he's just dying on purpose? Yep, he's ramboing in. He's like, I start the upgrade and then I die and then we do it again. <laughs> okay, that's, that's pretty smart. That's Is that how yeah, you guys kill like 20,000 walkers during the horde? That's a little I secret, mean, it, but yes, it is. It is slightly anticlimactic. I'm, I'm going to say say that, but I mean, <laughs> it is very smart. Hey, still very, I was like, uh, you're still paying the resource. Also 59. Yeah. It hurts you and resources. I think most people know of this tactic. Like gamers will figure this out in like the first couple of days. Like gaming mechanics, how they work, and how we can get the most out of them. It's just like. In your head, it's like, okay, game, game mechanics, new game mechanics. How do I use this to my advantage? Are we going again? I think so. Do they need more stone blocks? Do you guys need more stone blocks? I think so. We have somebody in the guild called Smasher, and he just gathers resources. So whenever you need resources, you message Smasher. And Smash is probably where? going right now. Nice Where's the story? Resources. I have so many resources. I'm that person in my line sometimes. Yep. That's true. Lou is because, also a resource yeah. guy. And then Chuck's the PvP guy. So, yeah. I have me. Do you guys have room for two more? So, me and my other bases. <laughs> me yeah, and my so many bases. Fun. I use them. I'm, I, I use my other bases sometimes to keep my resources so I can upgrade twice. Those resources, those resources that you need to level up. Nice. Just hey, smiling monster! I ended up in your base, by the way. 
I'm like in your base. So you're level 10 too, huh? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, well, this is my alt character. <laughs> <laughs> I leveled this character specifically to play with you guys because you normally have, a, have around like level 10 to 20 characters. Oh, what, what, what's your real character then? Your level 54. Oh, sheesh. Okay. Oh, How did you become the leader of Bitbender's Guide? Guild? Guild. Well, Bitbender started streaming The Walking <laughs> Dead and he was like, guys, I have no idea what I'm doing. So I spent half an hour on Twitch chat just walking him through how to build a base, how to put the station. And I was like, if you press G, I've made a guild called Bitbender's Guild. And then you just have to drain that. And as soon as I did that, like seven people teleported over to Bitbender and we got his base up to like level 10 in like 15 wow. minutes. That's hilarious. Yeah, that's awesome. that's cool. The same treatment you got, Jay Hoon, we, got, we gave to Bitbender. I appreciate you guys. Thank you. Yeah, I, pre I feel good being at level 10. Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to find you guys now since I died. That's your oh, the coordinates are yeah. M32, uh, 100 minus 115. Chuck said 66 wooden planks and 35 stone blocks. Oh, that's a lot. How much? 66 wooden planks and 35 stone blocks. Okay, I got... Oops. Wood. Planks. And I got it all. I'm coming. <sighs> oh, interesting. Lou said, what did Lou Oh, there's a question from Ra Mega. In general, where is the distribution pool for Deadcoin going to come from? I'm trying to imagine how this game will have a stable economy. I guess it's going to be like Champions Arena, correct? Like the people that spend it'll be the pool i'm not too yeah. sure question for doug yeah. yeah that's a question that's going to be answered in the next ma it's a very important subject so yep. you're going to have like zach and brando talk about that and i think the next ma is going to happen before the middle of december so like in two weeks the real question is when dungeons yeah, when dungeons, uh, they show a lot of, uh, a little bit of the, not a lot, but they show uh, uh, the underground <clears throat> uh, the train station, but we're going to have a lot, way more dungeons in the game. Small ones, s s like solo ones that you just go alone, others that you need yes. friends. And a lot, this is the thing that they're planning, a lot of the resources to upgrade the base in the like late levels only gonna be found inside the dungeon so i like that oh yeah. interesting is it also gonna be um like resources in dungeons are gonna be used to craft like the name weapons like michonne's katana sasha's rifle uh daryl's crossbow where you have to do dungeons and get like a relic or a component and then use that to craft the weapon or is it just gonna be for base upgrades uh, the Chuck first, can the first... these resources, or somebody grab these resources and put it in the base. Mm, oh, okay. The first iteration is gonna be about the your questions, by monster. The first iteration is gonna be for HQ upgrades, and then later, because the good thing about dungeons, they can always add content, always add different contents, and for example, in you can you can see in in a few zones nowadays there are specific buildings imagine that in fut in the future you can access the interior of every building of course some of them are going to be small with just a few resources others will be ve very difficult to finish because it's a confined environment so if a lot of walkers spawning not gonna be it's not gonna be like today that we can run around and kite the walkers this kind of stuff so so you'll be like in a building and there'll be like set pathways but there'll be like a horde coming at you so you need to yeah. be able to maneuver yeah, yeah. i like that wow. and some of the of the dungeons you're gonna maybe you, you enter there in level 20 and gonna be impossible to finish impossible to, to do anything and then after you level up a little bit maybe you can return there 
Will Sorry. dungeons rarity or like difficulty be based on like land rarity? So if you're in an ancient zone, will it be like an ancient dungeon? If you're in like a rare Picker. zone, will it be like a rare dungeon? Someone pick these uh, up. We don't have the. We never talk about that in IMA, but from what I know, yes, it's gonna. It's gonna <gasps> very awesome. Vary. I'm looking forward to that. Oh, Tiny, you might have to move south a bit because you might be blocking the resource. Uh, there you go. Who's that? Lucifer's picking them up. I think NFT Chuck saying, don't take the dinner. We, what dinner? Are you dropping some food here for me? I cannot DM you, Chuck. You have to DM me. Those are gala rules. I'm sorry. It doesn't work that way. It's <laughs> <laughs> true. <laughs> Trap. Oh, it started. Trap. Try not to die, guys. Oh. Oh. All right, here we go. What do you guys want to do after this? Level up tacos base? Give taco the VIP treatment? Hell yeah. Let's get a taco uh -oh. to level 10. Mm -hmm. Or is taco the lone wolf and so want to solo his base? Oof. That's a tough question. I mean, I, I feel bad. like for the I feel like for the good of the group, I should let you guys help me. <laughs> for the good of the group. <laughs> Why the hell am I stuck in this? I'm burning here. Where the hell I am? Oh, oh dog oh. explosion! Yeah. I'm like that, go run into the flames. <laughs> hey, hey, I've got a bandage for you. Right here. I'm, I'm oh. kind of... Right now I'm training sounds, sounds. the running skill here. Not the right. We don't have one, but like that. Oh. I put a bandage there. Yep, there you go. Oh, Jay, who are you back? I have your stuff. Yeah, I've been trying to get back, but I'm kind of lost. I'm, I'm, I'm teleporting to Bitbenders. House, so yep, and then you just have to there. go north, like north on no, the screen, in the top right corner, twice. Oh, no. <gasps> Tiny. Tiny's backpack's up for grab, guys. I don't know what's Ooh, in there. Grab it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Bunch of ammo. No, there's nothing in there. Maybe I've got a question maybe. about like the upgrades. Will will the new addition, like variant walkers, be added to the upgrades? Because right now it's still the old walkers, right? Like the ignited, the exploder, and mm -hmm. like the heavies. Will we get like the well walkers, the Winslows, the like B walkers, metalheads, all of those in the the future? Yeah, yeah, for sure. And one good thing about the future that we're not only going to have walkers, we're going to have like. Uh, human npcs as oh, enemies oh my it's infection oh, from the game like maybe whispers someone looted my backpack sorry chuck i'll bring you a plushie next time <laughs> will factions sorry. control the city centers or will you be able to control the city center because i know there was talk about like alliance and empires and factions in game yeah this is the kind of thing that we are like three layers of changes before the, the final product, you know? I think we're gonna have like a temporary thing, a second temporary thing, and then at least three levels and then the final release. So we can have like, for example, we can have, a, have small updates for the next months. They're gonna add things that are not gonna be the final way that the things are gonna work. But just so we can test things, we can expand. Yeah. Oh, they finished the upgrade. You guys want to head over to Tacos and let's get him some levels. Dang, I think I just got there. Hey, Jay. <laughs> you can tell. Yeah, what's up? What's up, Tiny? Did you loot my backpack? No, I, I didn't even get there. <laughs> if you look in the Walking Dead discussion, uh, Lucifer's tagged you, Tiny. It says, uh, thank you for the... Wow, the that's messed up. <laughs> no. Hey, give the stuff back. That's Did he not take ethical, the plushie? It was meant for either him or Chuck, so... <laughs> there is a picture there, yeah. Or maybe <laughs> just take a picture of the backpack. 
Uh, just where, the backpack. I don't know if you muted it. I am in Q32, right on the border of uh, R. And so are, are so you J going Boon? to the taco base? All you have to do is press O. Just oh. press O. Just press and o. that will take you to your base, which is in Taco Zone. This is Q32, right? Oh, Q32? Yes. Nice. Good to know. Okay, I'm teleporting to J home base. So many nice, people. I'll follow you I'm once I say. I think uh, if you're in Neff's guild or like the the Crimson Flames, the Gala guild, uh, Ventit is right next to Jehoon, so it's in the same zone. Just teleport to that, and then you can teleport, uh, walk down to Taco's base, because I believe uh, Taco's in is in the Gala music um, guild. Or... No, I'm in the Sages guild. You can go right to me if you're in that one. Oh, I feel there you bad. Go. Perfect. I I used to be in Nephilim's guild. You know what? I'm gonna go back to Nephilim's guild. Yes, I see right. how it it's is. Right. I follow you, Nephilim. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, dude. You no, know? well, I'm following Dog. No, I'm, I was following you too. <laughs> oh, oh Taco, what's the codes? Oh, you were following me, Dog. Uh, one fifteen. Yeah, because I just 15. teleported, and then I saw you <laughs> and my monster in town. I'm gonna follow you. 115, 15. Oh, oh it looks like we have to go in the Lead us away, bro. Yeah, we're we're Q32, walking the circle here, right? Yeah. What'd you say? What'd you say, Tiny? Oh, just asking. Yeah, Q32. I'm in Q32. Do you need so it was 115, 15? Uh, I need some wood and some stone. Just How do stone. I get a ranged weapon? You need to upgrade your talents to, I think, three, and then you'll be able to craft the basic pistol. Oh, nice. Yeah, I, I did level it up to three. So, okay, let me look how, where do I craft? If you press C, oh, you geez. can bring up the crafting menu, but you need to be next to a crafting station that is level three, and it will show you the resources needed to craft. I, I appreciate you, Smile Monster. I love how you explain things, man. <laughs> You've been breaking oh, that's what I'm a here lot for. for me, so... I appreciate you, my man. Uh, where do I I'm go? To... I lost you. I lost you. That's now. what you. I thought you were here to have fun. Here, I thought you were here to have fun. That's Ooh, part dang. of the process. Uh, fun is I answering questions, answer. interacting with the community, uh, okay, playing with okay. you guys. There's no one tier of fun. Oh, I'm just giving you a hard time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, you're just here to have fun, man. You know. <laughs> but uh, we're. Head south. You should see a green dot on the mini map. Go to the one that's to the southern location. Oh, I'm right next to Taco. I'm gonna start gathering resources to help him upgrade. Nice. Let me go I'll to. I'll give you more support, Taco. So, are you there, Taco? You, man, on my way. Uh, yeah. Yep, I'm here right now. I started gathering some okay, stuff. Went to the south of the. It's okay to ask for help, Taco. You know what I mean. You don't need to do every do everything oh, by yourself at times. Here. Wow, this was a really this was a great learning lesson for me. Thank you, Jehu. Of course, <laughs> we have HP one and one here. Oh, I'm here. I'm here to give you guys moral support. <laughs> Just be running around. It's an important job. Please don't underestimate moral support. We great job, Galataco. Sigurd again. When will characters have their own skill trees? Because I remember you you're talking about. Maybe the primary tree will stay the same and the secondary tree, uh, skill tree will be different? Or is it going to be like uh, just two skill trees for each character? Yeah, I checked this, uh, this info with the, with the game designer, the lead one, and they settle in how it's going to work. It's going to be like the primary skill is going to be one that's the same for everyone. Is a like advanced skill, like a lot of options there. And then the secondary skill is going to be unique for each character. Ah, uh, okay. Nice. So that's the final design that they're going to aim and implement in the next updates. Just nice. letting you know that might cause the issue from the previous playtest where some hero combos might be better than others. Yeah, there's a lot of balance. And even after they add the skills, we always gonna need balance from time to time, so it's gonna always happen. Good point. It's like the meta game from other games. The meta 
change sometimes from month to month. Oh and yeah, metas watches. will change all the time, depending on upgrades, weapons, and new uh, quality of life changes. Yeah. Hey, by the way, real quick, guys, we're at 31,983 subscribers. If 17 of you subscribe right now, that's 32K, you know? So everyone, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done so. I would like to see them uh, at, by the end of this stream getting to 32,000. I think that's a realistic goal, so... That, well, if Jaehoon, I, I I think it's worth mentioning if one thousand and seventeen people subscribe, Ooh. we'll be at thirty three k. That is true, man. I mean, that, that, why not? That's a good point. Yeah, I want every single. How much people are on this stream? Like sixty. Every single one of you guys better be subscribed. I'm gonna see the information of those who are not subscribed, <laughs> and I'm gonna hunt you down, guys. So uh, definitely make sure you subscribe, and um, yeah, just. Appreciate, but appreciate everybody just being here, honestly, and just enjoying the, um, enjoying the, enjoying the stream, and you everybody know here if, in the stream too. Where if we say? get to fifty thousand during this stream, I'm gonna give away a music track. Sheesh! <gasps> that's what? that sounds okay. So sixty of you basically gotta bring like. 50 people to subscribe and i think i don't i don't even think we'll hit it then actually but uh i like the enthusiasm talk but what about thirty two thousand? and you give a music track to me man i think that's oh and i give you a track you give me the track you know i think huh. this will be clipped and then when we do actually hit it somebody's gonna post well taco said in this live stream that if we hit this number he's gonna give away a music track that's you know during the live stream <laughs> yeah. during yeah. When we get to 50, I'll give somebody a track. Yeah, but everybody go check out what, what's going on in Gala Music. Definitely some exciting things happening there, Taco. Any leaks you can kind of provide uh, uh, to us, Taco, about, uh, you know, the excitement going on there? Yeah, I'm about to get to a level 10 base. Music token <laughs> drop in next month? What? That was, that was oh, you wanted a music leak. Leak, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, token, token next month. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, let's go. That that sounds exciting for sure. Heck yeah. All right, I'm on my How way. How are you to gonna lock us out of right your base? Now. I'm in his base right now, but he's just locking me out. I can't even get in his little room. Is that true? Let me in. I would like if to it's not in your on. HQ, you you won't be able to squeeze through the fence or the door. Only the people in the, the Crimson Flames will be able to access those oh, so uh, I to pathways. Little, I need to make a little gate then, huh? Uh, six. Oh, let's see. Uh, question about Empty Chucks asking when is the next content update? And of course, other people are asking about when is release. I think I'm going to have like, like a small update before the end of the year. Not big ones, small. And any like big update gonna be next quarter, twenty four. And official game launch, we don't have ATA right now, but stay tuned for the next AMA. Maybe gonna have more info in the next ones. Mm. And just of course to recap that we have the public development build up and running right now, and we're not gonna be turning off the servers. So the game is gonna continue till the launch changing phasing from different iterations for the next one and i think the best thing is if you have a nft hero you can keep the xp level so any game time that you have is always helping your your hero so that's the main nice. thing thank you we have uh in question from twitch what is upgradable tracks i'm guessing that's for taco and the music side it's a terrific question i thought this was a walking dead stream <laughs> well, you're a special guest, Taco, and people have questions. Is that how this works? Uh, yeah, so in the new tier system... Alan is asking, when can I buy the game? Oh, you, great you, question. You don't need to buy the game, Alan. You can even play for free. You can download right now, choose one of the five uh, free heroes, and play as long as you want. And of course, if you want to have different experience, you can, there's a selection of NFTs that you can purchase from heroes to, to choose which hero you're going to play, to land deeds, so you can in the future place and even collect rewards. 
and crafting stations also to help you in the game. So nice. But in if you think about the game, just download and start a little bit so you can know a little bit more. A lot of people are having fun right now playing the game. It's true. I need about a hundred wood is all we're left over here. Uh when did you check? Did you did you, did you just check? Uh just a second ago? No. Why did you oh, just okay. there? Yeah, I dropped a bunch of, uh, of wood metal stone. Hey, does anybody have like two gunpowder by any chance? Let's... I've got a bunch of stone as well. I can drop can I drop it off? Oh, you dropped a revolver. Oh thank you. Uh no, I still need I still need more wood. Okay, I'm grabbing wood right now. Sweet. So it uh, seems like we got a question in Twitch. What, what, somebody checking Twitch? So yeah, it was about the upgradable tracks. So for tracks, oh. um, we're going to be having tracks that are starting at a bronze level, and then they will get mm -hmm. to level up depending on their popularity. So if a bronze track sells out um, and gets it performs uh, to a certain level on the platform, uh, like basically makes the gal charts for a certain number of days in a row, then that track will upgrade to a silver and we'll release more of that track, but for slightly less money. Uh, and it'll keep moving up from there. So if, you're, if you've been on the music platform, a track like um, Sion released a track that has like 80 million monthly Spotify. Uh, so it was released in a bronze track, but it couldn't go anywhere from there, even though it probably should have. And so now if a track like that gets dropped, people can buy into it as it, uh, as it grows in popularity. Hey. Nice. Okay. Or if I drop a track and it's terrible, it just stays at bronze. It does what it's supposed to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, there's so much. Talgo, if you if you if you made music, what uh, what genre would it be? Ooh, that's um, a great question. Or so do you make music? I was, are you holding out on us? I was I at the writing camp. Oh, there's a bunch of gear in here. Now I feel like Jay Hoon. Like there's just a bunch of cool stuff on the ground. Yeah, I appreciate this, Taco. I'm just gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> Well, if it's wood, leave it on the ground. I need it for my base. Oh, my bad. Let me here. Let me drop some wood for you too, man. I want to help out too. You know, do my part. Uh, I was just in uh, Puerto Rico at uh, the writing camp for reggaeton artists, and I laid down some. So uh, everyone is at Taco first, Base. That's me everyone's at Taco Base. Yeah. Yep, so I think I might have a Christmas track coming out. Us. You have a Christmas track coming out, Taco. Uh, Yo Poppy is working on it right now, so we're going to see what happens. Let's go. That sounds interesting. Sounds fun. Okay, I'm ready to upgrade. Nice. Let's do it. Let's go. So since your base is in the corner, I'm guessing it's just going to be the other side that they spawned the, the zombies. I got a revolver, guys. Yeah, they so come from three can... sides. They come from over on this other side, too. I don't know why I put yeah, this. Yeah, dude, just because I, I can I can hear everyone. So if I speak in on top of anyone, just because of that. Oh, okay. Sorry. Sorry Doug. Wait, what would you say, Doug? You can't hear us? Not everyone. So that that's... Why can't you hear everyone? I can hear Taco. I think that was the this oh. Oh, Okay. Sorry. Oh, that heck yeah. Like, uh... It's yeah, like the other stream. Them. I couldn't. I couldn't hear Jorik for the longest time, and I felt so bad afterwards because I was just talking over Jorik every time yeah. he tried to say oh, anything. I feel you. To to listen to Taco, I, I had to like uh, turn turn on YouTube the up. There, I like and subscribe. Oh, I'm actually doing damage with this revolver. Heck yeah, this is fun. Don't shoot the firefighters. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> that's what sets them yeah. on fire. Just, just to make oh. sure. Or shoot the firefighters and take them to other people's bases. Ooh. The people in the corner, yeah, with the close, with yep. the close concept faces in the oh, corner. Oh, what the freak! Exactly. I already lost ammo. How the hell do I get more ammo? Oh, I just got. He it built there. it. No. Ah, what the hell? Dude, fat zombie. Okay, I'm gonna use this weapon. What's up? I got your back, dog. Oh, RNG's got another question for you, Taco. If I have a bronze track and it gets upgraded to a silver tier, do I get bronze rewards or do I get silver rewards? If you buy a bronze track and it gets upgraded, you are then also given a silver track. There you go. Very cool. So, yes. 
Ooh, shoot. All right, 15 seconds. We're doing great, guys. Dang, I'm barely doing any damage on this heavy, dude. Oh, heck Once yeah. you level up your mastery, you'll be doing a lot more damage with handguns. So people will specialize in certain weapons. I would like to be a range. Level okay, 10, we did it. Our mastery. Good stuff. That's real community intervention. Appreciate that, Paul. Hey, shout out to Paul once again for always holding it down with these streams. Uh, yeah. Could never say it enough, you know. While uh, you know we're we're here playing the game, Paul is holding it down with the tech. So appreciate you once again, Paul. Go, Paul. I can't. Wow, Paul, you didn't even even respond to me, man. <laughs> no, <I'm just> <laughs> <laughs> I'm with you. I'm with you. <laughs> I'm still waiting so, to for the timer here so I can teleport to the base. Yo, Tiny, are you here? We need to get a screenshot of this. My bad, Dylan. What are you saying? No, no, you're good. It's uh, Taco. Where are you moving next? You gonna you gonna move your base to another zone? Yeah, I have to go. You just go right down common, right? I don't want to get super crazy. <laughs> now I can hear Taco. Right. Now I can hear it. I was not he able wants before. To be in rare for all the nice stories stuff. that you get. I actually, oh, I actually it, skipped rare. Do you get? How? Is there like something special about rare? How did you skip rare? Well, so I actually, I actually have a, I actually have an epic deed. So I went, I went zero to ten in common, and then I went okay. ten to twenty in uncommon, and then I just uh -huh. now I'm in the twenties in in epic. If I'm only level 15 hero, I won't like I won't be surviving well there, will I? You, can you should that. be, because you can unlock the machete, and machetes have cleave, and they generally clear well up to like rare and epic. Oh, so maybe yeah. so I should jump right to rare. You think? Yep, that's what I do. Like once I hit level 15, you can build. You have to go to uncommon, place your base. You don't have to build anything on it. You just have to register it in the uncommon land. And then since the requirements to upgrade to rare is also level 10, you can just move over to rare and then place uh, your base in the rare zone. For now, Wait a minute. For now, now, you live in Epic now? Yes, for now. That can change anytime. <laughs> Where's your base, Nath? My base? Are, um, you, are you in a lone alliance by yourself? That's active? No, I'm at... No, me? Wait, what? Is your... your alliance active or is it only one or two people active uh, what's the say it's it's all the sages the sages of the red flame so like we're busy so we don't have time to just sit and grind to level 50 but you know we're, we, we play just <laughs> sacrifice for sleep a that's, little bit i do that's how do you think i play at all i play between like True. midnight and 4 a.m that's the time that yeah. i get to Nef, That's just join our just in. join the alliance. Just join the alliance, so we're all together, yeah. and then we can all play at the same time. Because you know, there's me, and there's Lily, who also plays in the middle of the night, and it's just Wait. me and Lily. <laughs> Wait, so are you Sages of the Red Flame? Yes, sir. Why can't I join? <laughs> are are yeah. you already a member? I was a member. You know oh, what? You I'm, gonna to leave. Leave I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave guide and join. Yeah, you have to leave. I'm gonna join. I'm gonna join your your guide guild. Nephilim. Sorry, smiling monster. <laughs> we should get a uh, we should get a photo. We should get a photo. If you're here listening to the stream, you're at Taco's base. Let's get a photo real quick. I'm trying to go there. Everyone, come through. Mobilize. Right oh, next yeah. to this, All Adolf right. Hitler's. <laughs> yep. Make sure you get oh, Adolf goodness. Hitler's headquarters. Yeah. In let's let's yeah. not do that. Oh, let's not do that. <laughs> let's go to tacos. Let's yeah. Let's go to the north part here. Yeah. Let's go to the base that says Galatago. <laughs> yeah, let's, let's not do that. And then yeah, the other base are gonna take a screenshot later, send to the dev, so we can always correct anything bad in the game. Look at everyone. That's so nice. Close. That's ah, we all mobilize. Here, Misha. Here. Oh, look at Lucifer coming through for the picture. This here, Misha cool. rocking her uh, rocking her Rosita. 
hey, why isn't my name popping up? I was in the same zone as Kimisha, and then I forgot where she moved to, and then yeah, it was nice Kimisha's to see her. Awesome, it's one of the one of those OGs. Yeah, kick your butt in Tweety and Townstar. In right. any game, actually, yeah, you know that. yeah that's, true. that's true. All right, I got my photo. Somebody else take a photo too. Sweet. Cool, cool. Thanks, everybody. That was fun. So whoever is watching the stream, I'm giving away a hero. The way to participate is just type in the name in the YouTube chat of what hero it is. The first person to type that name will be getting a rare hero. Ooh. I'm trying to learn from oh, Bitbin. That's <laughs> cool. Off you go. First person to type nice. in the YouTube chat. Thanks, Mike. Will get a rare hero. Uh, just YouTube. It's a cool giveaway. Oh, interesting. All right, let's have. I don't think I can. My keep track my of my here. my unofficial guess. Can I guess <gasps> Eugene? Someone's Is already it Eugene? guessed it. It's not Eugene. Oh, no. If you RTS gamer has guessed the correct character. Okay. It is a rare Daryl. So RTS Gamer, if you send me your Gala Chain address, I will be sending you a rare Daryl. That was pretty fast. I thought people were going to take a long yeah. time. And I think it, he's nice. here with us in the in the stream. Yeah. In the picture. Rigged. There's also, <laughs> <laughs> There's also slow mode. So like some people can't type more than once, more than like 30 seconds. So yeah, they had to really get lucky with their first guess. Yeah, we, we, we wow. have a little bit of jokes. Yeah, I just love how we're all standing still here. <laughs> I'm just looking at everybody's level. Just wow. What level are you, Tiny? Oh, 19. Okay, it's respectable. Yep. For those hey, of you watching, don't forget before... to like and subscribe. Hey. Before I finish. Time. Yeah, just say thank you to Smiley Monsters to be here. Also, Smiley Monsters, please, please it's share, a pleasure. share with us your socials here. Yeah, so whoever wants Ooh, to. Yep, oh, I yeah. can do that. You can find me over on YouTube, Twitch, and maybe X. Those are the three main platforms that I use. But if you do want a social link, I can just post it for you in the chat. Mainly public game content, mainly live streaming every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and I do videos every Tuesday and Thursday. Streaming Walking Dead right now because that's a game I'm addicted to. <laughs> hey, awesome. appreciate you, Smiley Monster. Yeah, I've been to yeah. some of your streams, man. It's fun. Yep, I see you in there all the time. Thank you for stopping sure. by. Of course, my man. But cool. All right. Uh, hey, see you guys later. Any last questions, Jim? Uh, just make sure you guys hit that like button, the comment button, subscribe button. We're going to be having more fun streams for you um, coming soon. So definitely keep tuning into every stream. I'm going to be having some exciting events in these streams. And so just going to keep the ball rolling. Appreciate everybody here who participated. And have a great one, Gala community. Later, everybody. <laughs>